Hello, this is Walker Physics, 4th edition. We're in chapter 7 on work and kinetic energy into the chapter questions. And this is question number 15. A young woman on a skateboard is pulled by a rope and attached to a bicycle. Hmm, let me see what I can do. Okay, that's the best I can do for that. So she's pulled by a bicycle. The velocity of the skateboarder is 4.1 meters per second in the X. So I assume the X is going straight. So that means her velocity equals 4.1 meters per second. The force exerted on her by the rope is 17 newtons X, 12 newtons Y. Okay, so she's got a 17 forward and a 12 up. So the 12 up is being wasted, okay, because it's just opposing her weight. This is, uh, or she's just kind of, you know, up and down with her arms. The 17 forward is the force that's making her move, and that is what is causing work to be done. So work is force through a distance. So we're looking at just the 17 meters. And just to make it ridiculous, it says find the work done on the skateboarder by the rope in 25 seconds. So we'll go back to our old standby rate times time equals distance. And we see that 4.1 meters per second times 25 seconds is going to give you 102.5 meters. So the distance is going to be 102.5 meters. We want to know the work done on the skater skateboarder by the rope. So work equals force times distance. The force is 17 newtons. The distance is 102.5 meters. Okay, so that will give work is going to be equal to 17, 42 and a half joules. Let's round this down. We've got two significant digits, two significant digits, two significant digits. So it looks like we need 1,700 newtons. So this is A. This is the amount of for or amount of work done by the rope on the skateboarder. B. Assuming the velocity of the bike is the same as that of the skateboarder, find the work that the rope does on the bicycle. All right, so this is easy. If you are, if she is going forward and the force, if the distance is forward and the force is forward, then the work is positive, okay? If the distance is forward and the work, the force is backwards, then the work is going to be negative. Okay, so if if the bicycle is pulling her to the right and she is moving towards the right, so the pull is towards the right and the distance is towards the right, then you have a positive work. If the force is towards the right, or I'm sorry, or if she's tugging on the string, then the force is towards the left, but the motion is towards the right then she's going to have a negative work, and it'll be the same. So B is going to be equal negative 1,700 newtons. Okay, thank you.